Hello, this is Seth Dwelling with another travel tip. I travel well, at least once a year on a plane and I like to arrive fresh. I assume that everyone knows, especially if you're a business traveler, although I usually am not a business traveler, I'm a ple pleasure traveler. But the goal is the same, arriving fresh, because you already feel run over by a truck by the end of your travel. Your hair is oily and your breath doesn't feel fresh. So at least you should look nice. And this is a way to help you achieve that goal. I'm using Scotch Guard. Scotch Guard is, it has several different kinds. This one is fabric. You can use it on couches or anything that isn't leather and it provides a protective barrier for uh, all your fabrics so the uh, offending liquids or food stains just can be wiped right off without staining. So, check it. The only problem with this is uh, two problems. One is the smell. I'm doing it inside and my bathroom is going to smell like industrial solvent for at least a day or so. But for this video, this was the easiest venue to shoot in. What you do is, or what I do, is I just spray it on and you can see it going on because it's a little darker than the actual fabric. And don't forget your arms and sides. Don't forget your other arm. <laughs> this is the arm I have trouble with. I only use the right arm. And also, also pardon me for the echo. I think it must be echoing off something in this bathroom, my voice. So what I do is, on a hanger, it's easier to get both sides of the garment. This is a wigger, um, merino wool blend t-shirt, which doesn't, it doesn't transmit, <laughs> transmit the smell of your body as much as a cotton shirt would. So when you wear on travel, the overall consensus is that you will smell less bad or neutral, I hope. And many people use merino wool as their only travel clothing. So,
There we go. Use that hanging. Oh. So, we're pretty well sprayed. It stinks. And uh, it's gonna dry in about three hours. I like the hangers. Like I said before, because you can get both sides in one go, as opposed to, say, pants, which you might want to lay on a flat surface, like a table with a drop cloth under the garment. You can only do one side, and you have to wait three hours, flip it. Do the other side also. Remember to spray your pockets because those will get dirty too if you put your you know dirty hands in your pocket or whatever. It's going to stain and if you don't want it to stain then it defeats the point of spraying the entire your garment if you're gonna have dirty pockets. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to show you a test. And I'm going to move this so it doesn't fall into the sink. So I've sprayed this. Yeah. What is it? It's a sweater. This sweater I've sprayed before. So I wore it on my trip to Russia in August and really was a good idea because I didn't have to bring a raincoat and take a raincoat, you know, more so less space for clothing means less weight to carry for me. So if I were to pour some water, see how it, well, it drips. It was, it was beating, then it was beating water. And then you can wipe it right off before it soaks in and then clean. Now, um, I've been also doing this to my normal Spring clothing, spring them because um, when I'm at work, I I don't want to go in there. I'm meeting after lunch with a big ketchup stain on my shirt or pants. I'm sure I've done that before, but with Scotch Guard, it minimizes that problem too, and especially in winter. It's March 10th right now, and you know, it's a nasty end of winter when the back of your car is all dirty road grime and you get in the trunk and it gets all over your pants. And Scotch Guard prevents them from getting really dirty really fast. So, that's what I have for you today. If you like this video, thumbs up, subscribe, tell your friends, leave a comment. I'm trying to get my voice clearer for you guys so I'm more understandable. I'm probably going to do a video about my voice and why I am the way I am soon but as for today this is the video and I hope you have a great day and hopefully it's sunny where you are. Thank you. Bye.